welcome to the rps group of school online classes students today we are in the continuation of the chapter kinds of materials in this module we will study about the properties of materials first introduction in this we will understand about the met properties of materials different materials have different types of properties these properties help us to decide which material should be used to make an object to choose a material to make an object we need to keep it in mind that first the purpose for which the object is to be used second the properties of the material for example most cooking vessels are made of metals and not of paper or cloth now students we will study about the different properties of materials one by one the first property is appearance second is texture third is hardness fourth is solubility fifth is ability to float or sink in water sixth is transparency now the first property that is appearance students the object around us look very different from each other this is because the nature of material is different from each other for example silver or gold is very different from wood this is because silver or gold shines whereas wood does not shine on the basis of shining property objects are classified into two groups number 1 lustrous objects second non lustrous objects on the basis of appearance objects are classified into solids liquid and gaseous states now lustrous objects and non lustrous objects first we will understand what are the lustrous objects these are the objects which shine examples are gold bangles copper wire iron nails etc non lustrous objects these are the objects which do not shine for example wood rubber tire etc now the second property that is texture by touching the object they are classified into two groups number 1 rough materials second one smooth materials first we will understand about rough materials rough materials have bumps and ridges on the surface which can be felt for example sandpaper jute mat rocks etc now the second one smooth materials the smooth materials do not have bumps or ridges and have a plain surface examples are glaze paper flower petals etc now the third property is hardness students we will understand this property by compressing the objects on the basis of compression they are classified into two groups number 1 soft material and number 2 hard materials what are soft materials the materials which can be compressed easily are called soft materials for example cotton sponge etc talc is the softest material talc powder second hard materials the materials 
which cannot be compressed are called hard materials. Examples, wood, iron nail, etc. Diamond is the hardest material on the earth. Now, that's all for the day. Thank you.